One of the things I'm really enjoying at the moment are the hand dryers that are out lately. I think they're excellent. Yeah, I am going to talk about hand dryers for a bit. Uh, I think they're really good. I think we could look back at this time, we might not even remember Trump or Brexit. We'll say it was a golden era for hand dryers, yeah? <laughs> Future generations will say, how did it take them so long to realise that more air was the solution? What was that? Because <laughs> we had the old ones for years, they were desperate. You know, the only good thing about the old ones was you could turn the nozzle up to face you and pretend to be Bonnie Tyler for a few seconds. That was all. <laughs> And then the new ones came on stream and everything changed. I really love the Dyson Airblade. It's a fantastic piece of kit. Yeah. For loads of reasons. First one, it has cut the time of drying our hands from 47 seconds down to just 10 seconds. That is a 77% performance improvement. I don't know of any other industry that's making gains of that size. Yeah. And for that reason, I'm not even going to cheapen it with a joke. Right? <laughs> Other thing, it has changed the position that our hands are in when they're drying. They used to be up here in constant motion like you were some kind of evil genius in the toilet <laughs> plotting to go out and kill all of your friends. Now our hands are down here, out in the open, means that the bloodshed can end. It's a good thing. <laughs> the real reason I love the Dyson Airblade though is that there's a moment now when you're drying your hands, when you get to watch your own flesh <laughs> being blown around your bones and you suddenly become aware of how fragile life actually is. <laughs> you're like, I've got to get my shit together. I could die any second. <laughs> Guys, I've been entertaining. Thank you so much. Good night. Thank you.